Welcome back to another video. My name is Andy and this is 75 Hard. The rules are pretty straightforward. Two 45 minute workouts a day. One of those has to be outside. Two, follow a diet. No alcohol or cheat meals. Three, drink a gallon of water. Four, read 10 pages of a book. Five, take a progress picture every day. Just a quick intro, my name is Andy, I'm from Swansea and I'm currently working and living in London. So 75 Hard, I've seen mixed reviews on it, but I wanted to see what it's actually like, especially for someone who works a corporate job. I'm not doing it with the intention to lose weight or gain weight, I don't think it's meant for that anyway. More I'm intrigued by incorporating the structure, routine and daily habits over a period time and seeing the difference that it can make. The types of training most days will be going to the gym for a weight session, cycling, yoga and walking as I'm currently recovering from groin strain and I'm kind of limited at the moment in terms of some of the training I can do. Eventually I'll also be including Brazilian Jiu Jitsu and running once I can get back into them injury free. So one of the rules with 75 hard is a daily progress picture. I'm not sure how I feel about this part yet, but I will also do a weigh in alongside of it and do a little bit of a before and after. But like I said, I'm not doing it for the purpose of losing weight or gaining weight, but it would be interesting to see if there's any difference. Obviously the biggest difference in weight would come from the diet side of things. So depending on if I was in a calorie deficit most of the time or in a calorie surplus. And as you can see, this is my attempt at doing some sort of bodybuilding pose. I don't think I'll be entering a competition anytime soon. Diet on this plan isn't the clearest from what I've kind of seen or read and as I'm not focused on losing weight or gaining weight I'll just eat what I usually eat on a day-to-day -day basis. The only thing that I'm probably going to limit are things such as chocolate, sweets, crisps, fast food, those kind of things really. But I am a firm believer in kind of everything in moderation. No alcohol, that's another one. I don't drink much alcohol anyway, so that should be completely fine. I am interested to see kind of how it feels at social situations, not drinking. Water, I have a hydro flask, so four of those a day will be about a gallon, I believe, plus anything I kind of drink when training as well. And then the final piece is 10 pages of reading every day. This is something I like the idea of and I'm looking forward to implementing it and seeing how things go. Okay, first book we're gonna go for to start off 75 hard is thinking either James Smith, not a life coach. I think intention. The way of a seal, think like an elite warrior to lead and succeed. Or, or Tuesdays with Mori, an old man, a young man, and life's greatest lesson. So it's between those three. 